guys it's your girl slay sims if you're new here welcome make sure you guys like this video make sure you're subscribed and make sure that you click the post notification bell because youtube don't be notifying y'all when i post and i know y'all love when i post so today ladies and gentlemen i am introducing you guys to my new lp called teenage pregnancy so the star of this lp is this lovely lady right here her name is trinity i'm gonna give you guys a brief little explanation on who she is how she got pregnant that and the third you know just her little backstory so this is trinity trinity edwards she is 17 years old she is a senior in high school She's the only child to her parents, William and Samantha Edwards. She currently lives by herself. As you guys can see, she's in her apartment. Um, she decided to move out of her parents' house because she just didn't like living there. So back at home, Trinity would always want to go out with her friends, go to party, you know, just have fun, enjoy her teenage life. Trinity basically thinks she's grown and she thought she could just go out with her friends, come back home as late as she, she wanted to. But her mom was like, hell no, we're not doing that. Her mom is like super, super strict. Her mom wouldn't let her do anything, literally. She just always wanted her to stay home. Her mom was always trying to shut her down. So her and her mom's relationship is like horrible. Like she literally is always arguing with her mom. It's just not good but her dad on the other hand is a very chill cool laid back kind of dad you know her and her dad's relationship is very you know bestie bestie buddy buddy you know her dad lets her do whatever she wants she's a daddy's girl um so her parents usually bicker about her a lot because they have such differences on parenting her so trinity saved some money up from youtube and working a part-time job because she was working during school and she decided to um get her own place and her parents was not supportive of her you know trying to move out and they was just like no you're too young you know you have a house why do you want to move out into an apartment like you're 17 like you're not even in college yet so why do you want to move out so quickly long story short she convinced them they let her go fast forward she finally moves out, you know, she's making money from YouTube, she's independent, you know, so, she, so, she, so now she can just do whatever she wants. She thinks she's grown. So last fall, she was feeling kind of bored one day and she made a Tinder, which is Simda in The Sims, and she found Javon on there. If you don't, if y'all don't know who Javon is, Javon is from My Family Living Drugs LP. She found him on there. They was texting for a little bit. Javon invited her over, they had a one night stand, and after that, you know, they would hook up occasionally, you know, do some nasty, freaky stuff, and a few weeks later, today, she finds out that she is pregnant. So, as you guys can see in the intro, Trinity actually found out last night, so this is the day before, um, so the baby father, Javon... He is actually in California right now for his 21st birthday. I know, y'all. I know it's crazy. A 21-year-old just got a 17-year-old pregnant. Like, that shit is crazy. But she's turning 18, y'all. So, hopefully nothing crazy happens because, y'all, her father is a lawyer. Her father is a freaking lawyer. So, yeah, he's a freaking, he's an attorney. And then her mom is a businesswoman. So, you know, they making money. And they don't play about their daughters. So if Javon tries to, you know, do something crazy, her parents got her back. So right now, she's just very tense. So it says, her moodlet says, unwanted pregnancy. Trinity did not expect this pregnancy and is really not sure that she wants it at all. But it's happening. What should she do? And then her other moodlet says, pregnancy freak out, pregnant. It hits Trinity now how young she still is, how little she wants anything major and life-changing happening at, at this point in time, how little feels ready to handle such a, such a thing. Huh? 
And yet this pregnancy is exactly that, major life-changing. Impossible not to freak out. What will her parents say? Her friends, the father of the child. Oh my gosh, so she's freaking out right now. She doesn't know what to do. Guys, she's just all over the place. We are actually going to go over to our parents' house um, to try to tell them. She's really scared. Um, she wanted to talk to Javon first before she told her parents. Javon is living his best life right now, and I guess he'll have to talk to her when he comes back. But she's going to tell her parents, and she's just scared. I'll be scared, too. But before we go into that, I want to give you guys a cute little tour of her little apartment that she got here. It's going to be a little glitchy because that's just how apartments are when you go in tab mode. So. This is a little overview of the house. Cute, cute, cute. So over here is a little living room. She has her little TV, her little couch. Over here is the washer and dryer. She has some packages on the floor, her shoes and whatnot. The door out to the left is her bathroom. Y'all probably seen it in the intro because she pregnant. <laughs> so, you know, pretty simple and too crazy in here. Um, over here is her kitchen. Lovely, lovely kitchen. Um, so as you guys can see, she got a whole bunch of snacks because she doesn't cook or anything. She just be snacking. But she gonna learn to cook, y'all. She gonna learn to cook because she can't, she has a baby on the way, y'all. She has a baby on the way. But yeah, this is her kitchen. She has a nice little view of the city. Real nice, real nice. Okay, so over here is her bedroom. So her room is real cute. It's her bed. Pictures on the wall. You know, she got snacks, games, water. Over here, she has her makeup stuff, her laptop, you know, more cute stuff, teenage girl stuff over here. <laughs> and then if you go to the second room over here, we have her YouTube room. So this is where she films for her YouTube. So yeah, now that she's having a kid, she's going to need more than just YouTube checks, you know? With her YouTube checks, she can only afford, you know, just her rent and a couple things that, you know, she wants. And of course, her dad gives her some money when she needs it or whatever. But, you know, she just applied for a job as a daycare worker. So as you can see, she's a babysitter, daycare worker, whatever. So she thought that, you know, working here would be the best thing. Not only just to get her a lot of money, but she'll be working on weekends. And when she has her baby, the baby can stay at that daycare. So nobody has to watch her baby. She doesn't have to pay for a babysitter because she has, she works at a babysitting company or whatever. So that's her job for right now. And then she also has YouTube on the side as an extra um source of income but you know right now she only has two thousand dollars but she has to put this in her savings for her baby so that's what she's gonna do right now oh shit i didn't even mean to do that i did not mean to do that but let's just say her dad gave her a thousand dollars as an allowance whatever i don't know <laughs> I don't know her mom and her mom and dad are very I don't want to say rich but they're they got a lot of money okay they have a lot of money so if she ever needs something her dad especially is gonna give it to her so yeah she's a spoiled little brat with a freaking baby and an apartment so she's just spoiled so we're gonna give her a bank account Let's open a main account main account we're going to deposit money we're going to deposit two thousand dollars and that two thousand dollars is going to be saved up for the baby okay so let's do career direct deposit we're going to do 50 50 so 50 of her paycheck goes to her main account and 50 goes to her savings so yeah because it's just her and the baby so this is going to be the baby's account the two thousand dollars or the two thousand dollars and twenty 2020 and then she has a thousand three hundred and thirty seven in her main account so she has to you know use her money wisely 
before we head to our parents' house, let's check our needs, see if she's hungry or anything. I don't think she's hungry. I think she's pretty good. Okay, so I want her to film a video first. Let's go over here and let's go to the Sims. SimTube. Let's study the trends and see what's trending. Congrats on landing that sweet job. I think it's going to be great for you. Thanks, Dad. Thanks. <sighs> see, her dad is so supportive of her. Her dad is literally her bestie. Um, the following are now trending mixology, photography, happy vlog, celebrity life. I have a question. If anyone in the comments can help me. So, you know when you when you study trends on this little YouTube thing, when you have things like mixology and photography, how do you like film a video like that? Like, do you cuz if it was a vlog, it would say vlog. But let's record a new video. Let's do beauty tips i guess i don't know let's do a makeup video let's do a everyday makeup tutorial or something like that i don't know i think she she went grocery shopping yesterday and she has a lot of groceries in her refrigerator because she doesn't know how to cook because before this big pregnancy all she used to do was go out and get food or doordash food so now that she's, you know, going to be a mother, she's going to try to learn how to cook and try to, you know, save her money and not, you know, eat out all the time. So she has a bunch of stuff in the fridge. So she's going to teach herself how to cook for her and her baby. Hey, neighbor, I'm bored. Want to hang out for a bit? You can socialize with whatever your heart desires. Um, no. Our landlord wants to have fun with us. No. Actually, you know what I just realized? Our landlord... I think she's our landlord, but I think she's pregnant, y'all. She's not pregnant, but she has a baby. So maybe we can ask her for some, like, baby tips or something. After she finishes her video, I'm going to have her ask Myra for advice, maybe. Okay, I guess not. Whatever, she left. Whatever, we can ask her another time. And you know what's so funny? Um, I think all her neighbors have a baby. Like she, I think she's pregnant. And then Myra, who we just seen, she is. She has a newborn. So yeah, everybody here is pregnant. All the girls on this floor is pregnant, which is so crazy. So if she ever needs help with anything, she has her neighbors. So yeah. Um, beauty tips video. Let's call this video um every day makeup routine description hashtag makeup hashtag soft glam hashtag beauty hashtag um i don't know beauty guru you know, we gotta, ha we gotta put those hashtags. All right, so I think we're gonna go ahead over to our parents' house because they do have work tomorrow. So we don't wanna wait until, you know, the end of the afternoon to tell them. So we're gonna tell them now. Okay, guys, so this is her parents' house. They live in this huge, huge valley home. I did build this house, y'all. So if y'all want it, I'll have a link to it in the description. I made it myself. So if y'all want it, y'all can have it. Ooh, can't we knock on the door? Um, hello? Okay, guys. So we are outside in the backyard with her dad. We still can't get in the house. I don't know why. But we are out here with her dad. Our mom's inside. We are going to ask him how his day was. I'm so scared. Let's him about his day. Be like, Dad, how was your day? Before you start, you know, talking to him about this. Right. He's like, hey, sweetie, how was your day? My day was good. Oh, she's hungry. And then we are going to 
Just tell him the news. Just tell it to him. Uh, I'm scared. Pregnancy and family. We announced on once a pregnancy. Express feelings about pregnancy. Jongi Shuna. Oh my god. Oh no. He's upset. Oh my god. No. Teenage pregnancy. This sim has just learned about their teenage child being pregnant. Will they react well and offer support or, or react poorly and refuse to support them? I think she's going to, I think he's going to react well and accept to support. Oh snap, mom is out here now. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, her mom's giving her a hug. Hello mother. And let's tell her about the pregnancy. I know, I want to pregnancy to her mom. Mom, I'm pregnant. As y'all can see, yeah, her, her relationship with her mom. Oh my god, her mom. Oh my gosh. I think her mom is going to reject poorly and refuse her support. Because her mom... Is just really mean. So it says, worst case scenario, Trinity's parent reacted very poorly to the news of her pregnancy. Angry words, angry words flew. So her mom probably cursed her out and was like, oh, hell no. Nah. You cannot be pregnant. You cannot be freaking serious right now, Trinity. Ask for advice about pregnancy and baby. Ask for money for child. Tell about being parent. Be Tell about being pregnant single though. Single. Well she is signal sig signal. She is single. Well they're not together technically. They just had a baby together. She just got pregnant. So she's signal. She's single. Pusin Kalang. <laughs> oh. She's like, I don't wanna hear it. I don't wanna hear it. Oh, her mom's she mad as shit. She's like, I can't believe you would do some shit like that, Trinity. Um, single parent. It is hard to tell another sim about not having a serious romantic partner all the while being pregnant. Trinity couldn't help feeling ashamed. Oh, Best case scenario from her dad. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Her mom is like, Trinity, I cannot believe you. Let's ask her mom for... Let's just see if her mom would give us money. Oh, her mom gives us money. Oh, thanks, mom. Thanks, mom. Thanks, mom. But, you know, her mom is pretty upset with her. I don't know why we can't get inside the house. That is so annoying. All right, so I finally fixed the issue with the door. I had to set it as the front door. But I just switched controls to the parents. And I think the dad went to work. Oh, he didn't go to work. Where is he? What is he doing? He's grilling something. So their moodlets are... Oh, I think both of them are just very stressed. So it says a devastation and news from teen child's pregnancy. Anger and panic take over Samantha's mind as she tries to interrogate what she has just learned. Integrate, sorry, not integrate. Integrate what she just learned. Her teenage child, pregnant? What sort of madness has made this happen? What levels of stupidity, recklessness, and irresponsibility plague her child from then to let such a thing happen? Um, single teen parent, not only is a family member pregnant in their teens, but they don't even have a romantic partner to own up to it. Be an adult and support the baby. What a mess. <laughs> Literally, he didn't even, like, he didn't even say much. He said, I'll talk to you when I come back. Like, nigga didn't even say, like, oh, um, I'm going to support you. You know, give her a heads up or anything. He just said, I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to come. I'm going to link you when I get back. All right, let me enjoy myself before you try to tell me I have a kid. <laughs> it says, won't enable mistakes. Samantha does not believe that giving money to her pregnant teen will do any good. 
They made this mess for themselves. They learn to be an adult and deal with it. Only through hardship they will become more responsible, it seems. So yeah, as you guys can see, her mom is very strict. Her mom don't play that shit. Like, especially now that she's pregnant, her mom is going to go nuts. Her, her mom is going to go bazonkers. Like, she still gave her money because, you know, it's her kid. She's like, nah, this is the last time you're going to be asking me for money unless until the baby is actually born. Because you need to realize that you made the mistake and you need to own up to it, you know? Like, it's not like this was something where, you know, you was hold, held against your will to get a baby. No, you and whoever decided to have a kid, decided to have unprotected sex, and now you have a kid. So that, this is your this is your problem, you know? This is your problem so where's the dad at what is he doing he's still grilling instead of you grilling how about you call the meal all right so let's see what the dads is feeling quite the news shock takes over william's mind as he tries to integrate what he has just learned his teenage child pregnant what sort of man is okay we read the same thing so that's the only moodle he has i feel like the mom is just more mad than the dad because he's more supportive well he's he's the dad you know i feel like a mom will be more mad than the dad if they found out their girl is pregnant you know so we're gonna switch controls to um trinity real quick so that we can have dinner as a family all right so she's gonna go ahead and grab a meal of this lovely lasagna that her mother made her mother grabbed that shit and said i'm eating on the couch i'm not sitting next to you Wow, her mom is really mad at her. Where did that at? Well, if the dad ain't here, then we gonna pack this into a sack lunch. To take this home. Because B's hungry. Because, oh, dad went to sleep. He said, I'm, going, I'm tired. She's probably like, why did he go to sleep to leave me with this crazy woman? So, she's gonna go ahead and talk to her mom. She's gonna, you know... Be the big girl that she is, and she's gonna stop arguing with her mom so much and go talk to her mom. So, I'm gonna have her sit down, put this in her inventory because we eat that for lunch tomorrow. And let's, um, maybe we can ask our mom for advice or something. Ask for advice about pregnancy and baby. So our mom gave us money. Maybe we can ask her dad another day for money. But I'm surprised her mom gave her money. I thought her mom wasn't going to give her money. Uh, okay, it says, Nothing to gain here from asking for advice. Considering their reaction to the pregnancy announcement, Trinity should have known better than to ask these parents for advice. They weren't too interested in discussing anything parent parenting to Trinity's situation. Too, up too upsetting for them, Trinity imagined. Uh, yeah, so her mom is just really upset. Her mom is like, I can't, I can't, I can't take this. This is too much for me. Her mom is truly devastated about this. Um, so is Trinity. Like, oh my god, imagine being in her like position. Like, I would be scared shitless. And just for that, since you don't want to give us advice, we taking this, we packing this whole lasagna for a pack for a sack lunch. But this is her old house. This is where she used to live, y'all. Let's put the walls down. Her room is back here. This is her old room. Cute, cute. Y'all should already know her favorite color. Well, y'all don't know, obviously, because you just met her. But her favorite color is blue, y'all. And this is all the places she's been with her family. Because, you know, they be traveling and whatnot. Um, it's pretty late to go traveling back home. So I think I'm going to have her um, sleep here tonight because it's really late and her dad or anyone is not going to drop her home. So, um, yeah, it's too late. So she's going to go into her room, her old room, and go to sleep. But I'm going to have her take a vacation day tomorrow. Like Trinity is taking a Okay, good. She's taking a day, a day off. So good. But yeah, I don't think she would want to go to school tomorrow because she's definitely stressed as shit. Okay, guys, so it is the next morning. Trinity just woke up. She spent the night at her parents' house. 
well her house technically um so she's very sad this morning she said it says not ready for this from pregnancy sometimes a uh, the torturous nature of being pregnant at a time when you don't want a child hits you like a train. Oh, let's go ahead use the bathroom. Um, because I think our parents have work this morning. Let's brush our teeth. Take a shower. Let's have breakfast. Let's make some eggs and toast. It's pretty something something simple. <sighs> poor Trinity. Um oh, poor baby. Yeah, her parents are asleep. I think they have work today. Um, not completely sure. Let's see. I think they do. I think we can see on here, right? Yeah, she he has work at eight AM. He has work. He needs to get up. She has work at when does our mom have work? We don't know. Okay, so she's trying to cook, and her mom is like, this is inappropriate, please stop. Her mom was like, no, you're not cooking in this house. Go to your house that you wanted to move out in and go cooking. Oh, shit. Oh, no. How do you start a fire in your own? Oh, my gosh, Trinity. Extinguish. Oh, my gosh, Trinity. Trinity. Let's clean the floor before our mom gets even more mad. But she went up to work. I think she went up to work. Um, why is our dad not at work? Oh, she's right here. Oh, she's mad. She's like, Trinity, get the hell out of my house. Get the hell out of my house now. All right, so we're going to go because we just embarrassed ourselves. And our mom doesn't want us here. Okay, guys, so Trinity just took the bus back home. So she is so ashamed of herself. She feels so stupid. Oh, my gosh. She's craving sweet foods from pregnancy, ice cream, cookies, cupcakes. Oh, my God. Anywho, let's talk to our neighbor because I know that she is expecting. So let's um announce unwanted pregnancy. Why does she? Okay, let's let's introduce introduce ourselves first. Let's do a friendly introduction. Be like, "Hi, I'm Trinity." Okay, so we introduce ourselves. So let's see if I ask for craved food item. Isn't that weird? All right, let's ask her. Let's ask her. Be like, "Do you have any sweets, neighbor? Cause I'm kind of, you know, pregnant and hungry." Do you have it? Oh, she went to go get it. Oh, it says getting some food, ten dollars. Oh, you have to pay for that. Oh, you had to. I had to pay for you to give me sweets, bro. Like, oh, she made a video. Ooh, look how much money our video made. Cooking with Trinity mac and cheese. Yeah, she made mac and cheese the other night, and yeah, she made a video about it. But yeah, what did the lady even give her? It says firefighter, minty freshness, craving team. Um, Trinity feels much better now that those food cravings have been satisfied. So, all right, let's just tell her we're pregnant, of course, because it's not like she's gonna know off rip, because you know she's skinny as hell right now. She's like, really? Oh my god, you're so young. She's like, yes, I know. <laughs> like, yeah, I want to cry too. Just complain about hormonal, hormonal changes. Um, can we? You can't ask her for advice. Like, what the heck? She's pregnant too. I guess not. Like, this is so annoying. But let's just complain to her about hormonal changes. Be like, I can't. Like, I just crave. Freaking ice cream at 10 a.m. And like I'm crying, and my parents they just are so upset with me. My mom, 
literally just kicked me out of our old house because I was cooking and I'm like oh my god blah 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 the lady's like you know what I just feel like um you should really you know try to get a job if you don't have one already and I just wish you luck throughout your pregnancy you know it's gonna be a rough ride but at the end you're going to be very happy with your results because you're going to have a very healthy, beautiful baby. Or whatever the lady's saying. Whatever. All right, we can stop talking to the lady now. And let's go and... Let's edit this video. Let's put our food in the fridge before this shit starts getting spoiled. Let's edit the video. And then... We're going to add effects and then we are going to add transitions. But yeah, this is, I'm going to end this part here, y'all. Um, Trinity is just super stressed, you know. She's going, why is this lady in her house? Did I invite you in here? But I got to give her a makeover because she's probably going to be our new best friend. Because we got nobody else. <laughs> But yeah, I'm going to end this part here, you guys. Trinity is super tense. She's stressed. Her mom and dad are very disappointed in her. Her mom literally hates her guts even more. <laughs> she doesn't hate her child, but that's how Trinity feels. I think in the next part, we are going to be talking to Javon. Hopefully, because he'll probably be back from his California trip by then. So yeah, we're going to be talking to Javon. And Javon is probably going to be having to talk to his parents. So, yeah, it's just a lot of stress, y'all. It's a lot of stress. But, yeah, I'm going to end this part here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys if you guys have any ideas for this LP, let me know in the comments. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.